How's it going guys? In this video I'm going to show you quickly how to reduce the crashes on NVIDIA graphics cards whilst playing Apex Legends. So this method should reduce the number of crashes that you get until a patch is released. The Apex Legends developers team said on Reddit recently that they are working closely with NVIDIA to try and fix the problem. But until then, these should improve and reduce the number of crashes that you get. So the first fix that you can do is right click on your desktop, go to NVIDIA control panel and once this loads up, you can go to help and make sure that debug mode is checked. This should definitely decrease the number of crashes that you get on NVIDIA graphics cards. So if you aren't doing that already, if that's not checked already, make sure that it is. Uh, a second check that you can do, and a second test that you can do is once the game is opened, you can open the task manager, go to details, and find easyantichete.exe. And if you go to the set priority and put it to low, this should also reduce the number of crashes that you get on NVIDIA graphics cards. Another change that you can make to reduce the number of crashes that you might be experiencing using NVIDIA GPUs is to go to the Origin Launcher, finding Apex Legends, right clicking, go to Game Properties, go to Advanced Launch Options and type in FPS underscore max space space 80 and click save. Capping the FPS at 80 has been shown to significantly reduce the number of crashes that people are experiencing using NVIDIA GPUs. Some final changes that you can make to improve your gaming experience using NVIDIA GPUs. This won't particularly help with stopping crashes, but it will make the gaming experience smoother using NVIDIA GPUs when playing Apex Legends. It's to right click the desktop once again, go to NVIDIA control panel, go to manage 3D settings here. You want to go down and select maximum pre-rendered frames and put it to 1. You want to go to power management mode and select prefer maximum performance. You want to go to Preferred Refresh Rate and select Highest Available. You'll also want to go to Threaded Optimization and select On. And you'll also want to select Vertical Sync and put it off. So if you should then apply down here, there'll be a button that says Apply down here. Making these changes should increase your the smoothness of the game that you're playing and hopefully should work in coordination with the other changes that you've made to reduce crashes. Thanks very much for watching. If you found this video helpful at all, please leave a like and consider subscribing for more Apex Legends content. Thank you.